Stangibalisco here. If I were elected President of the United States, one of my first official acts, or unofficial acts, uh, depends how you look at it, would be to call together the leaders of some of the most powerful nations on earth. Russia, China, India, the United States, and some of those who aspire to be powerful, North Korea, Iran, all of the countries that seem to be involved in the contemplation of wars amongst each other, I would call them all together for a meeting at some neutral site. I don't know exactly what that site might be. How, how about, oh, Reunion Island, something like that. That's a good name for it. Just um, somewhere not associated with any country, but yet associated with the entire world. I would call these leaders together and I would ask them a question. I would ask that we each contemplate a question and offer our answer. The question, why should we ever bother to use our resources to fight wars with each other? Why not instead we take all the resources that we have and combine them in a joint adventure to explore outer space, to conquer the universe, conquer meaning in a figurative sense, of course, to go to the moon, to Mars, to discover how to travel faster than light, to do all these things that they did supposedly is the philosophy for the original Star Trek series, uh, Gene Roddenberry and other imaginative minds who just happened to live in California, but that doesn't make California any more special than any other place like Deadwood, South Dakota. But nevertheless, suppose that I were to call us together and invite all of the leaders of the world who wanted to come to offer their opinions, to offer their input and insights, not to create any treaties, not to discuss any differences, but to ask each other the question and see if we can provide a good answer. Why not? take all the resources that humanity has used for so many centuries, and rather than use them to fight each other, which only results in human tragedy, misery, destruction, and waste, use them to explore the universe. Suppose also that you were a space alien somewhere out there watching Earth, looking at us, looking at humanity, and wondering, when will they be ready? Will they be one of the few who join the race of the greater citizens of the universe? Or will they be those, uh, one of those who decides instead to incinerate and annihilate itself. And suppose that you were to see this behavior on the part of humanity. What would you have to discuss at your next joint meeting? Comments are open, so are imaginations, but indecency, profanity, sarcasm, and combative remarks are closed. Stangibalisco is signing off. Until next time, until I read from you, and we all read from you, so long.